Oh my god. I think I'm gonna throw up. No, no, don't. Oh, I can't. God. I feel awful. This is the worst decision I've ever made in my life, and we haven't even left the ground yet. It's done, Nora. Are you sure you're okay with this? Look, I'm not looking back. Are you gonna hold up okay? Yeah. Yeah, I guess. No, no. Hey, don't guess. You gotta know. Otherwise, look, we can call this whole thing off. No, no. You can't do that. You can't do that. You're absolutely right. We have to keep going because the alternative is even worse. Thank you. Thank you so much, Bo. I mean, not many people are gonna get this, what we're doing. But I will always know how hard this was for you and how brave you're being for me. Thank you. You're still holding the bag. I wanted to make a little speech, but since you got a jet, and I mean jet, this plane is beyond. <laughs> yeah, yeah, come on, so. <laughs> I'll keep it short. This is to remind you of what you fought so hard for when you get out of that surgery, ready to jump. Awesome. For real? Yeah, I saw this exact pair online and I was gonna order them. But it's much better this way. Mom, Dad, come here, check it out. Oh my word. Oh, Destiny, that's so sweet. How did you know my size? Like anybody can miss those big feet. <laughs> Thanks, Des. I'll wear them for my first steps. Will you take a picture? Mom? Yes, yes, yes. I may miss your first steps, but I'll be there for your first jump shot. Definitely. There's a reason surgeons don't get involved with their patients. And promising young medical students become surgeons instead of GPs? You may not want to, but you can't help getting involved. Caring more than you should. But I always move on. Do you? And the feelings just go away? Not always. Because it doesn't work like that. The more you try to push them down, ignore them, the stronger they come back. Is that how it is for you too? For everybody. Um, I should call my mom and let her know we're coming. So do I get to ride shotgun? Hmm. In your squad car? You know, because you're not going to let me out of your sight. And we're going to need to get a car seat for Bree. I'm not kidding. Jessica, there was a dead guy on your terrace yesterday, and there's a good chance the guy who did it lives here. I can't believe that we're talking about Jared. If he's telling the truth, I'll be the first to apologize. But until then, if there's any chance he's lying... Jared Banks is not a killer. I hope not. But whoever killed Wayne Landers is going to kill again. Why? Because Delfina said so? She turned you into a believer? Delfina said she kept seeing Nash's death. Like, that was the answer to the question. Who else was there when Natalie Nash died? was there, okay? Listen, it was an accident. Jared's a good guy. H have you seen him with Natalie? Have you seen him with Bree? That can't be an act, can it? No. Maybe. It's one side of him, the side he wanted us to see. So you think that he's hiding the true Jared? The guy was a con artist, right? Was. And he can't hide from Natalie. I'm getting the feeling she's asking some questions. It's complicated. So then tell me. Damn it, Jared! Talk to me, okay? I am not an idiot. I can handle complicated, but this, this ducking. I'm this sorry. Talking dopey. Just talk to me. Just tell me how you can, how you can do this. Evil thing? Jared, there's nothing evil about you. Except maybe my resume. This isn't you. He, he forced you. He forced you to do this, didn't he? Landers, he came, he came to town, and he, gets, he figured out that you were here, and then he, and then he heard the Buchanan name and um, figured he was going to get a payday out of it. He's the one who beat you up at BE, right? Yeah. Okay, good, I knew it. I told him to do it. What? I told Landers to beat me up. I even gave him a security pass to get in and out of B.E. You planned this whole thing? Yes. So you lied to the police and to Jessica and Brody. You 
light me? Yes. Is everything alive? Because I found you by Lander's body, and you told me that you didn't kill him. Is that a lie, too?